Uh, it feels good. Uh, it, uh, it's it's feeling good all the time now, and I'm I'm getting more used to to the rink and uh, to everything. So it, I'm I'm uh, I'm enjoying the, this time. So it feels good. How have you felt that you fit in with with the lines that you've been on, and, and how do you and what feedback have you got from the coaches? Uh, yeah, the lines and the coaches helped me a lot. Uh, they helped me with everything. They know I'm I'm new to, new here and new in this country, so they they helped me a lot to to get used to it. And uh, I think that's uh, getting better every day. So so I'm happy with that. Do you think you have a shot to make the opening night roster? Or do you think about that? Uh, I'm just thinking about playing playing my best, and uh, uh, of course that's that's my goal. And uh, I, I'm but I'm just thinking about playing my best uh, and uh, hope for the best. For you personally, what what changes in your game, or how does your game look different when you play with more confidence? Uh, uh, probably I'm moving the puck more, uh, make more plays when I'm more confident out there, and I'm feeling. Feeling like I'm getting starting to get more more confident. So uh, uh, still still more more to come. I think I'm uh, I can like move the puck more and make more plays out there. Uh, but it feels feels good. And uh, when I'm starting to get confident here in the in the small rink, I'm uh, think I'm going to make more plays too. Where did that confidence first start happening? This this time was it the Traverse? Was it development camp? Was it this training camp? Or did you... uh, I think it started down in Traverse when I get used to more the rink and, and stuff like that and with that uh, the confidence comes so I think it yeah, started there. Rick Bones has talked about your hockey sense and how good it is. Were you worried that it would be difficult to transfer that to a smaller rink? Uh, I don't know if I was worried but I, I thought about it and uh, because I haven't uh, like tried uh, the small rink here before uh, but uh, it feels good and uh, I, I'm starting to, to get used to, as I said to the small rink. Does your brain process things like angles and where the puck's going and where your line mates are? Yeah, a little bit like that uh, to, to get to know know the rink and it's, it, it is a big difference from from the rink in Sweden. So, yeah, it's uh, I'm getting more used to that too. That hockey IQ, where does that come from? Do you watch a lot of film? Is it more something you feel out when you're on the ice? Where does uh, good question. I don't know actually. It uh, maybe when I was a little kid, I just used play used to play like a lot of uh, land hockey uh, on, on the street, and I think just you play you, the more to play and the more fun you think it is, the more you get the hockey sense and stuff like that. A lot of times, the adjustment people have in the NHL is the size of the size of the players and the speed of the game. Um, in preseason games, have you felt intimidated at all or anything with the size and speed of the game? Uh, no, I've, I've felt a difference uh, from Sweden, uh, but uh, I think I, I it, it feels good, uh, so I can uh, I think I can can handle that, so it feels good. What's been the hard part about coming over? You mentioned being new to the country. Obviously, you look comfortable on the ice, but what's been the hard part? About uh, the, yeah, as I said, it's a new country, and uh, everything is uh, everything is new for me. Uh, so it's like the adjustment to. To get here, but I, I got a, I got a lot of help here, and I got some Swedes too, Jan, uh, who's helping me and and uh, stuff like that. So that helps a lot to me. And but yeah, that's uh, that is it has been an adjustment, but uh, I think yeah, I got help and uh, everything is fine. Uh, you obviously have Frederick and Oscar, but what about John Klingberg? Has he uh, has he been a key part of all this for you? Yeah, he helped me a lot. Uh, helped me with the small things, so I don't have to worry about that. So I just. Can focus on being good on the ice, so he's he's helped me a lot, and he's a he's a really good guy. So uh, I met him in Sweden before, so he's he's a really good guy, and he helped me a lot. Do you watch any TV in English, or do you try and watch it all in Swedish? And I would say he watches his in Russian. So. Uh, <laughs> I think I watch uh, pretty much in Swedish, but uh, but uh, we watch uh, English uh, like shows in Sweden too, so uh, a little bit of English there too. Uh, but uh, I think. Uh, I'm trying to get my English better, so I try to watch a little bit. But I'm watching in Swedish too, as well. Did you get taught at an early age English? It seems in Sweden that a lot of the players have a good grasp. Uh, yeah, we do. Uh, actually, in the, like when we are like almost uh, 13 years old, we start to get used to to English and uh, start to learn some English. So I hope that helped me as well.